Hello, I'm Dr. Tara Graff from Mission Cancer and Blood in Des Moines, Iowa, where I focus on lymphoma, specifically CLL patients. Today I presented on the key updates from our ASH December 22 meeting. And what I would say is the most exciting or two of the most exciting updates that we've learned um, is one, we have seen F, like excellent PFS and efficacy in an all oral regimen using a Brutinib and Venetoclex in both our fit um, and healthy patients as well as our elderly or patients with you know other comorbidities. Um, the Captivate trial which looked at our fit patients um, using a fixed duration cohort meaning end of treatment finite treatment versus um, what we call a um, an MRD cohort that looked at patients that went on to either receive no further treatment versus more treatment with a drug called the Brutinib. Um, the efficacy in terms of disease-free survival, progression-free survival, and overall survival was excellent, which was really great to be able to offer our patients all oral therapy without having to come into the clinic to receive you know, IV therapy. Um, another study that was presented um, at ASH that you know offers some true promise is the triplet combination using a calibrutinib, venetoclax, and a venetuzumab um, in the treatment naive CLL population. Um, we know that there is an unmet need in the high risk CLL group, specifically patients with the TP53 mutation, and this triplet combination, um, although early, um, does appear to really um, offer patients an excellent response with what we call undetectable MRD in nearly all patients, whether they have high risk disease or not. So seeing more of that in the future and how that data plays out is gonna be very exciting.